Hey you, it's Jess here and welcome back to my channel. Today we are reorganizing my kits. So, some drip from my drink. But basically all my kits I keep in these Happy Scrappy albums. But as you can see, it's gotten a bit, a uh, bit out of hand. I have been buying a bit more kits recently, um, hoarding some kits. And, um, well, this one's fine. This is my, my, my ones that actually are planned for each week. So I'm going to keep these in here. But I do have it out because I got some new kits in the last haul that you would have seen. It would be one of the last videos on my channel. Um, but I, so I don't know if I want to, like, change up my summer, um, outline. My summer, sp anyway, whatever I'm doing for summer. Anyway, because this has kind of just gotten out of hand and um, it's just not really nice to keep them like this, I picked up, I finally picked up a big um, two inch binder. Sorry, it's not focusing on it. Uh, from Avery on Amazon. And then I picked up, so I've got a bunch of kids here too, these inserts that have the two slot, um, which everyone seems to be using. If you want to find um, these inserts, go to Andrea's Amazon Favorites. They're listed on her YouTube descriptions. Um, Scribble Prints Co. YouTube. And they're in her Amazon fa Planning Favorites. And they are just like the two 5x7 pockets. And yeah, so I picked up a pack of these. I'm hoping one pack is enough. I know a lot of people put two in each one. I don't know if I want to, um, I, th I can't remember how many there are, maybe 50 slots, so I might have to put back to back. That's probably easier to put back to back because then you have more room. But the two inch binders, so it's going to be a nice big um, allowance here when it gets really fat, but I just bought a purple one from Avery, it's supposed to be a durable one. I know, I feel like all reviews of binders on Amazon are like, this isn't actually durable. It's like, well, apparently none of them are, so whatever. But I don't plan to do any, like, um, over-the-top stuff with this. So, yeah, I decided I'm going to move my kits into here. But first we have to take them all out of this stuff and maybe organize them. I don't know. I got some Disney stuff. I have some you know, different seasons, so maybe we could try and split them up. I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to just zoom through taking all of these out because it's going to take a while. Even zoom through, I might even just cut the footage, honestly, because it's going gonna, it's gonna to take ages. So I'm going to start emptying this beast here. Here is my sticker kit collection. So this was that one um, album, and then this is the second album. And then a lot of this is actually in a third album, which I already got rid of. Which are the new kits here? Those are the new ones I just got. Um, and then this is the third lot. So yeah, this is my sticker collection. You see, they were getting a little bit bent in those albums, so it's probably best that they do get moved along. But I think now it's time to organize them. Um, I feel like summer's about to finish, so I don't know if I want to start with autumn. Like, we we'll start with seasons. Autumn, winter, spring, summer. Maybe. <laughs> but autumn is about to get some more as well. Feels like hard to. I suppose we could just do what we have, and then hopefully we have leftover inserts so we can just bring across into other sections. Okay. <laughs> so this one's obviously summer. I feel like this could be spring or summer, but I'll put in spring, spring, summer. But I also want to have a look at these, and maybe I'll change up my summer lineup. I feel like that's summer. So I have a lot of summer. Um, I just went ham this summer. This is Belle, and then I have the Scribble Prince Go one, which I use the Caress Press one, but I saved the checklist to go with that. So I think that's, um, other. 
I suppose we can go in the Disney group, although I see it as a more of a Rococo set than Disney. But I'll put it with Disney, so Star Wars, I guess, we'll go there. Um, well, these could be, like, not so much Disney, because we have Disney parks and, like, specific... And these Disneys are they're summer, so they're going in there. So I guess I will be splitting up, except for Disney parks. So we'll have their own little area. I suppose this is Disney park, so... Um, that can go into like other, like um, cat cafe can go into other space, other, this one I think is spring, this is um, other, then this is parks, and this is parks, and then this is Halloween, Halloween, winter, parks, this is travel, so I'm going to do a little travel. I'm just like putting these everywhere. <laughs> travel. I have my little travel section of one day traveling again. Um, this can be another Halloween. Then we have other. We have other, which is friend stuff. I guess this is just Disney other. Um, farmer's market. We could say that, that is spring. This I feels feels very wintry autumn, so maybe we'll put in autumn. Summer, I think. Wedding is other. I just don't see myself going to another wedding. This is I think a leftovers from this one. So let's put those together. Uh, I feel like that's autumn. Other. This is extremely old. It's ancient. <laughs> um, like my my first. No, my second New Year's Eve set. I think that's gonna go in like, and these are birthdays, so maybe celebration kits can go together. All right, we're getting there. <laughs> also, see is like what I already have in my collection. We have summer, summer. This museum one I think is very autumn feeling. Um, do I want this in autumn or Halloween? Like this witchy one. We'll put it in autumn. We have Father's Day, we'll put it in celebrations. This is like a wintry, Christmassy one. Um, parks, I got two of those. <laughs> um, this is Halloween, like old one. This is autumn, and this one is autumn. And this final one, I would say, is summer. Okay. So, we got a bunch of stuff all over the place, and then these are the new ones. So this is anytime, anytime. I could say that this is autumn. Um, at any time, I guess. More autumn, summer, summer, and autumn. Okay. So now. Um, I actually want to look through my summer kits that I have lined up for this year and see if I want to replace any. So I think I moved some, obviously they've all moved around <laughs> since I, uh, so I definitely want to move my strawberry one up and get used. So I might move this one out and use beach day the week after because I do want to use it. Then some monthly, then it's that. Okay, so these are my, the summer kits I definitely want to use this year. Let's have a look at anything else. It really grabs my eye. Um, <clears throat> I think I want this golden owl to be the last one that I use. And I think I'm going to go into autumn early. So maybe we'll cut off. Um, summer, it's August 16th. Oh, sorry if the like just keeps going in and out. Focus. So that means I only have one left. So do I want this more Hawaii one or this small pool one? <laughs> um, I'll use this sun kissed one. Just use some different artists as well on my planner because it's a lot of me already. <laughs> So, okay, summer's done, and it's going to finish because I thought the warm tones of this set would actually look really good at the end of summer. Um, yeah, and then we can go into autumn, which I'm not ready to select. So I'm going to put this away. 
So now everything can go into the binder. So we're going to start with um, seasonal, aren't we? So we're going to start with autumn because these are probably the most they're going to be filtered through and used and autumn is the next one. And I'm definitely probably going to use this July one. So I'm going to put this at the front. Um, let's put the two aesthetes together. Probably going to use one, of, definitely going to use one of these. And then how about we put this old pumpkin patch in? So, in the back of this one. Ooh, it's a full... This top pocket's a bit annoying. There you go. Come on, you can both fit in there. It's probably just a large cello from um, being in a mystery. So, then we've got the first pocket. And then we have, um, try and put the newest stuff in the front here and then the oldest stuff behind. So we have super old cross press kits in here, which do need to be used up, but it is not enjoying putting back to back. So we'll, co we'll come back to that in a second. We'll flip and then put it in. So put these two in. And then on the back here, we'll put this one in. Yeah, that's much easier. <laughs> and then I think we're gonna, oh, I've, except for this one where the pocket only opens in the front. All right, I'm still learning. I gotta learn how to use these. I know lots of people use them, but I have to learn. <laughs> then we're gonna put this one in here and we're gonna leave the rest of this slot um, this one because we do have plenty of autumn kits coming um i say that yes okay we're gonna just continue through the seasons we're not gonna do like holidays in the seasons okay we're just gonna keep trundling on so this is gonna be winter which we only have like so this technically could be um, Christmas too, but I think I was just taking it as a winter kit. And uh, we only have two winter kits, so... Oh, I've already ripped this one, of course. Of course I've already ripped a pocket. Typical. <laughs> um, that's all my winter kits, so I definitely have to be buying winter this year. And then we're going to do spring. And be a bit more careful with putting stuff in. <laughs> so it's just um, it's a tight fit. It is a tight fit. So put those two in there. Just put in one set at a time. I think kit at a time that'll be easier and be nicer in the pocket. And then we have this one, and then we'll leave the rest of this pocket. Um, <clears throat> for any other spring and then we get into summer which I have a lot of but we, next year we'll um we'll make sure to use some of this stuff up <clears throat> just so so we won't have to buy as much summer next year which is nice I don't know why I always end up with so much summer stuff <laughs> because it's like it's not it's my least favorite season of all time. <laughs> I just hate being hot and it's so hard to keep like I think it's much easier to warm up rather than cool down. So I don't like it. <laughs> so let's put all of this stuff in here. Yeah, these are always tearing. Typical. <laughs> Oh well, they're good enough pockets for what they are. I'm not going to be like messing with them that much because this is like storage storage. Alright, so we have one more space for summer in there. <laughs> so that's all the seasons done. Let's do some holidays. So the next big holiday obviously is um, Halloween. So let's put some Halloween stuff in here. So this is like some ancient Halloween, like super old Darcy art. And this is like Darcy art from last year. So I do want to use those up eventually. 
And then we have, of course, re-release of Haunted Magic and two um, dead insides. Well, one full and one leftovers. Do I really want to keep the leftovers? Let's take it out. I suppose they're the extra girls, but I think I'm fine with the girls that are normally in the kit. So I'm going to take out this one. And we're not going to hoard that. I just don't need to keep the leftovers, you know? So is that all of Halloween? Cool. <laughs> I don't have any Christmas at all left over, so we're going to get into other, I guess. Actually, I think I will get do the celebration kits first, so they're out of the way, because um, it's like holiday then celebration, right? So we're going to put these in. Shove these both in. I don't know if I'll be using, I don't know about using these, but um, it's just good to have them just in case. It's a celebration, and I guess we'll put in the Disney parks next. What was that right under here? Travel. I'll put travel next because I'm more likely to travel rather than go to Disney. So we have like a, two like Europe travel ones here. Let's put one at a time. That seems to work better for these inserts. Ugh. Come on. Two European ones, and then we got Tokyo. And now we'll do put Disney Parks in because they are, you know. Um, so I'm going to put all the Disneyland Paris ones because I'm more likely to go to Disneyland Paris. I'm going to put both of the Halloween ones together. And I've got Christmas and it normal up here. And then we have the two American parks, Disneyland and Disney World. From that crazy time that all these kids came out. And then we have the Galaxy's Edge one. Cool. So that is the dizzy stuff done, so now we can get into others. It's starting to get a bit bulky now. Oh dear. Um, let's put some Sailor Moon in, because it's pretty. And we'll put, we have the two versions of these back to back. Sorry if you can hear a truck. And I'll put Cloud Busting behind this one, because it's very similar. Though it's not Sailor Moon, it's clouds. <laughs> um, I think I have to start like destashing a little bit, so I'm gonna get rid of this um, October mystery from last year. Then you have like the two kits that remind me of Andrea, so I'm gonna put these in here. I suppose I'll keep one wedding kit around just in case I ever get invited to a wedding and can go. Um, we'll put my like doubles to the side here. So then I guess we'll put the Sabbath Monday mystery behind here. And then control alt delete and dream. So this is my second control alt delete, but it's too pretty not to have, just like I have dead inside. <laughs> um, the cat cafe is going to go in the front. That's probably going to end up being what I use for the week of Heidi's birthday next year. And then we just have the superhero one. And I think in this pocket, I'm just going to do the Rococo set. So that is all of my kits. I think I only destashed the one and some leftovers. Um, yeah. So I got a lot of kits. This is already pretty full. <laughs> oh dear. But I do have the rest of the thing. And obviously it's going to start emptying as I plan out my autumn kits. Um, at least two... I don't know, three, four, so a couple of these will be put into my main planner for autumn, but yeah, so it's good to not have them in that sticker albums anymore, but look how 
this this ended up pretty dang wide. I guess this is why people have multiples of these binders. So maybe I should get a second binder. Um, let me know what you think. I guess I can add it to my next month's order because this is a lot. And maybe I could separate um, seasonal from, like seasons from everything else. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go buy a second binder. But I think I, I definitely have enough inserts um, to cover me for a while. But yeah, this is a lot. So <laughs> we're gonna have to deal with that. Um, I won't get another binder for a month, but so this is gonna have to live as this big chunk is. <laughs> But otherwise, I hope you enjoyed this reorganization of my kits. Do you organize your kits this way? Um, and I assume you also split up such a big um, uh, collection because, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I don't have like that many kits, but it's still quite a bit. But if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more. I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll see you next time. Bye.